and a couple of late entries. These are the Coles brand of lemonades. This one is a standard one with sugar, 0.5 stars. And let's have a look here. It is pretty high up there, 11.4, so over 11% sugar in this one. Let's give it a go. That's not bad. I think for a fair comparison, I'm gonna have to put it against the Woolies one. So here's the Woolies one. That's a quick refresher. Woolies one's a little bit less on the sugar count. So, different glass. Let's see how it compares. Wow, that was a surprise. So, in terms of preference, definitely like this one more. This one has more of a lemon taste. It's it probably because down to the sugar, it's a little bit sweeter, but this has a more natural lemonade sort of taste. Whereas the Woolworths one, this one has a bit of a sour taste to it. Now that's something, so it is a little bit less on sugar, but you know, if you're drinking it as a treat and you want the better taste, the Coles one actually tastes better. Pricing, they're identical. So that one I think is 75 cents. This is 75 cents. So they are, if we're talking lemons to lemons, this is the better one. So I'm gonna have to put that above this one. Having done that, it is now in the firing line of the Schweppes Zero Sugar. Okay, let's compare these two together. Trips first. Chips. Coles. Okay, that was a pretty simple one. Shrimp still comes out on top simply because it has more crispness to it. It's just a bit more fresher. Whereas this one, I think it's because of the extra sugar content. They've, um, they've got a really nice, sweet, lemonadey flavor. But compared to this, it's just a little bit flat. It's not as crisp or bright. What a surprise. So the Coles one goes into one, two, three, four, goes into the new fifth place ahead of Woolies and Sprite. And the last of the supermarket brands, this is the zero sugar version of the Coles lemonade. Okay, does it beat Woolies again? It's not hard to beat the Woolies one. The Woolies sugar-free one is all the way at the very bottom because it just tastes like nothing. This one has a taste to it at least. It's just not, it's not pleasing. It's a little bit too sweet. For comparison's sake, I guess let's put it directly against Woolies first. Okay, Woolies first. Oh, that's terrible. Okay, some chips. And the Coles. Oh yeah, Coles one's better. Woolies stays at the bottom place. So I think next we're gonna put this against the Audi brand. So here's the Audi supermarket brand. Let's have a go at this one first. This is the sugar version. The non-sugar version of the Audi supermarket one is all the way in last place with the Woolies no sugar one. So let's see if this fares any better against the Coles zero sugar. Mm, pretty terrible. Okay, grab a chip. Yeah, definitely better. So again, Oh, glad let this last. This thing's moving up. So we've got Sprite Zero Sugar. Let's now put this against the Coles version. Freshly cleaned glass. All right, Sprite first. Coles next. 
Here's a bit of a surprise. I like that more than this one. So what's next? Let's put this against the regular Sprite. Wow, what a surprise. That, for me at least, tastes better than that. Wow, this is a surprise now. Now the Sprite and the Woolies Lemonade, I've put them on equal footing. So really, the Coles is now up against the sugar version of itself. Didn't expect this to drag on. I'm gonna top up some chips. Okay, regular sugared version of the Coles Lemonade first. Wow, this is a really big surprise. These two, I can barely tell the difference between them. This one's definitely slightly sweeter. No surprise, that one has sugar. This one does not. In fact, the Coles one has a fair bit. If you recall, it is 11.4 per 100, so that's over 11%. This one, quite surprisingly, oh, they're claiming four stars. I don't know how good that is for you. Obviously, zero sugar here. What are they using? Okay, they're using 951 and 950. Pretty standard, I think one of the other ones is also using this. Uh, but in terms of flavor, can't complain about this one. This one is excellent, actually. So I'm gonna have to put these two on equal footing. They are going, let's see. They are going equal fifth behind the Schweppes Zero Sugar. That is quite a surprise. Couple of quick conclusions. Best flavor, Schweppes Lemonade. This one's fantastic. Best flavor, Zero Sugar, Schweppes again. And here's the Value King, because these are equally good tasting. The Coles branded ones are 75 cents. These are the value winners. Alrighty, nice and simple conclusion. Everything laid out in the front row here are the ones that I would go to without hesitation. So, Schweppes 7up, Lido, Riverport, Schweppes Zero Sugar, surprisingly. The Coles ones, sugar and no sugar, are both fantastic. And then we have Tier 2. So Sprite and the Woolies Lemonade, both of these are acceptable. In fact, in this tier, I'll probably actually choose the um, the Woolies one because this is only 75 cents. Whereas this, depending on if it's on special or not, could be anywhere between $2 to $2.50 or maybe even more. So this one will get the win in this category. Now here are the ones that are okay. I'll, I'll accept them if, if I need to. So Sprite Zero Sugar, it's okay. Kirk's Sugar Free, it's okay. Black and Gold, this is okay and the regular Kirk's. The best value one in this group, I would say is the black and gold. This one's I think own, well, under a dollar, that's for sure. And finally, we've got the ones which are, unfortunately, these are the Crocs. I wouldn't actually buy these, they taste bad. Uh, this one is, oh, actually both of these. These are from Audi supermarkets, and this is the sugar-free from Woolies. This one might as well just be a slightly sweeter version of tonic water. That's all that tastes like. And these two, that tastes funny. And this one has literally no character whatsoever. So there you go. I'll put up some tables and things like that um, with some adjusted scores according to price and also the sugar and health ratings, etc. So make up your own mind, obviously enjoy them in moderation. If you like the video, give us a like. Cheers!